uh, played a strong role in the transmission efforts. Just to avoid conflict of interest, I must tell you that we had been married for 10 years before we started collaborating. So she had her own MD career, we just started to collaborate. So it may be a career suicide, but it is not a conflict of interest. <laughs> uh, I should tell you that uh, the data presented here are preclinical, and we are owners uh, uh, of patents, and also we are co-founders of two companies that are trying to translate this to the clinic. They are called Ashwatha Therapeutics and Orpheris, and we are managed by the Optins Conflict of Interest Policy. The product that we are going to talk about today is being tried for, uh, is going to be uh, uh, tried for uh, dystrophy and cerebral palsy, and I'll tell you more about it. So the main point I want to try to tell you is that when you take a hydroxyl-terminated polyamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamidoamid